What is going on, YouTube? Bringing y'all another episode of the IRS Mud Mower. So today, I'm going to be working on the steering. Uh, I'm going to be using the original... Well, this part came off of the four-wheeler. This came off of another piece of a four-wheeler I had. Which is just a sh steering shaft. Wow, I can't talk. Uh, the original steering shaft of the four-wheeler is right here. I just kind of got it sitting in there for right now. And then I have, then I have this original bearing from the four-wheeler that I'm going to be using. Making some mounts for that. Steering shaft off of one of my old Dodges which I really just need the U-joints off of, but I'm going to try to utilize this as best as I can. So basically it's going to sit like this. I'm going to cut this shaft shorter. Still going to put that bearing in here, so I'm going to mount it about right there, which the bearing sits in between here. Then I'm going to cut this, shorten it, 45 with the U-joint, motor shaft, another 45 to the steering shaft. Let's see if I can show y'all this. So pretty much, we're gonna be making mounts for this bearing here. Measured it, cut it out of paper. That's what I like to do before I cut out metal, obviously. Also something like Traces on some metal, cut it out. What are you doing? It was at this moment that he knew he fucked up. All right, guys, so that wasn't going anywhere how I planned it, but that's just kind of how this stuff goes, trial and error. All right, guys, so I got the diff on. It's not bolted down yet, but I got it on here, so that's good. Uh, for the steering, I'm about to cut this. I'm going to show you what I'm going to do. I cut the spine piece off the boiler shaft that way I could use it with the tie rods and everything and uh, welded it onto this original piece for the mower that way it would still fit down in there and then I have this piece of pipe right here this tubing or pipe whatever you want to call it and uh, there's a stopper right here so it's going to weld I'm going to weld it right there on that little stopper and then this is going to go in there like so yeah, make the weld right there, right here, and that one's already welded, so. Not too terrible, especially for flux core. It's not that bad. So now I'm gonna be making this weld here.
in the mower. Well, it didn't come out too bad. All right, guys, so got the tire rides on. Well, they're just sitting there, but. They're just kind of sitting there for now, but that's how it's gonna pretty much look. Turn the wheel. I still gotta adjust them, so they're not quite all the way right, but it didn't come out too bad. How I was first planning to do it was like kind of definitely not gonna work. I don't know what I was thinking, but trial and error, you know, it's coming along pretty good. Um, I did put the front diff on. It's not bolted up yet. Just sitting there. Um, I saw the bolts in it right quick, but steering is pretty much almost done. So at least it's kind of laid out. Hopefully it doesn't get in the way of the drive shaft and everything. But I uh, can't really see. I'm not going to really better tell until I get the motor. Still don't know what motor I'm putting on it yet. I'm thinking about a Predator 670. That would be pretty badass, but who knows? But yeah, thank you guys for watching. If you have any suggestions, please comment down below. If you're new to the channel, you know, hit that subscribe button. Give me a thumbs up. I'll catch y'all in the next one.